All right, Psalm 23, a Psalm of David. A Psalm for David. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not be in want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. Here you're going to lie down in a comfortable place. A green couch. A green couch. A green pasture or a green couch. Now this guy says a green pasture. So he slept out in the open in the field. Keep going. How can you? Let it, um, where? The next one you read oh. number one. He leads me beside quiet waters. He restores my soul. He guides me in paths of righteousness for his name's sake. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For you are with me, your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil, my cup overflows. Surely goodness and love will follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell on the house of the Lord forever. Would you like to dwell with God forever? Yeah. All right. Uh, here it says... You prepare a table before my, before me, in the presence of my enemies. Mm -hmm. All right. Before that, it says, "I will fear no evil." Mm -hmm. Before that, even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, what happens when you walk through the valley of the shadow of death? You, like get scared. And... The only place fear exists is where? <laughs> Inside your brain. As I put in God's word into your brain, it will remove your fear. When I was in jail, I was afraid. You understand me? Yes. I was crying. You don't trust anyone in there. And yet, it says that you make me lie down by green pastures. Your green pastures... In, in a cell with a man that is upset, I believe that could defeat him in a fight. You know why? Yeah. He was so angry, he was going to bang his own head against the wall. Mm -hmm. Do you know what that means? What? That he was going to bang his head on the, on the wall by himself? <laughs> they think you did it. No. It's not that they would think he, I did it. The thing is that, remember the Tai Chi movie? The old man, yeah. his son married a, a girl from the United States and she was very angry. Yeah. That one time the Chinese man just banged his face against the wall. <laughs> yeah. Who caused it? Technically himself. He, he did himself. it himself. But who was causing most of his problems? The girl. His oh. wife. Oh, my. So... Sometimes people are so bothered by their problems that they do things they shouldn't do. Like, start thinking about, what if he attacks me? You know? The wolves. You, you read the story about the man, or I told you about the man that practiced with his sword, right? Samurai? And some wolves were approaching him and he walked right past him with zero fear he didn't even pull out his sword and the wolves decided not to attack him if they had i believe those the wolves would have won but because it's it's too many you know but he had so much confidence that the wolves decided not to attack him Have you seen the video of the girl that swims with the great white shark? Hi. No. She holds her breath for five minutes and swims, and her friend, a male, a man, holds the video camera as she swims with the sharks. With a great white shark. Some people are very strange, and they have no fear. Can we go to sleep? Yes, go to sleep. Thank you for reading with me. 
All right, we read Proverbs 31. The first thing that comes to mind on Proverbs 31 is red, red wine. You know why? Why? In Proverbs 31, it says, give wine to people that are, what? Thirsty? Not or thirsty. Bad. The people that are dying, perishing, people that are in pain. Give them red, red wine, and they'll start singing red, red wine. Right? Mm -hmm. They forget about their troubles. But not a king, because a king has to be sober. And I'm raising you to be a king. And whether you make it as a king of the other humans here or not, it doesn't matter. You must be like Uncle Tom in Uncle Tom's cabin. Mm -hmm. Who was he? Black slave. He was a slave. But did he whip the old woman? Nope. They ordered him. She can't carry the cotton? whip her and he refused to whip her instead he carried her bag of cotton that's a hundred pounds plus his own bag of cotton he used his strength and then when the white ma the evil white master found out about it he t he ordered the other slaves to whip him very good leave it alone please what is that my tablet yeah. That's a coin? Mm -hmm. Dollar sign. Dollar sign. Okay. Yeah, Put it on the table. Alright, so don't whip an old lady. But mostly they won't tell you to do that. They'll just say, carry the drugs for me. Shoot them. Beat them up, Max. Mm -hmm. And you refuse to do it. That's what I want you to be. A man that makes his own decisions. Mm -hmm. Uh, good decisions. That's why you got to read the Bible. This is so nice alone. All right. Good night. Good night.